This is a quick review of the installation of the File Open plugin on a Macintosh computer running Mac OS X version 10.5 or 10.6. That would be Leopard or Snow Leopard. Uh, because Snow Leopard no longer supports the Get Info method of installation of plugins, the easiest way to do either operating system is to directly install the File Open plugin into the Adobe Acrobat or Adobe Reader plugins folder. To do this, first find the copy of Adobe Acrobat on your machine. Usually this can be done by opening the finder, going to the Applications folder, and then choosing either Adobe Acrobat 9 Pro if you have it installed, or Adobe Reader 9. In this case, we'll choose Adobe Reader 9 by double-clicking on the folder, and then highlighting the Adobe Reader application in that folder. To find the plugins folder, what you do is put your mouse over the Adobe Reader, then use a right click, show package contents. You'll then see a folder called contents. Double click on that to open it and then double click on the plugins folder to open the plugins. This is the folder into which you'll be installing the plugin. Uh, to find the plugin, open the file open install DMG that you downloaded from the plugins.fileopen.com site or which was left on your disk when you attempted the automatic plug plugin installation. You'll then see a finder window that shows you a number of plugins. These are meant for different versions of Adobe Acrobat and different versions of the operating system. For Mac OS X, Leopard and Snow Leopard, you'll be using the File Open 8 Acro plugin folder, uh, and that will be installable on versions of Acrobat 8 and 9. Uh, to, the, the plugin is actually contained inside the folder. There are a number of files, but the actual folder itself represents the plugin. So to install this, just drag the folder into the plugins folder for Adobe Acrobat. You may see a warning that you're replacing a previously, previously existing plugin. If this is the case, just click Replace. The plugin will be copied and installed. Uh, you can then run Adobe Reader and then select from the Adobe Reader menu about 30 pl third party plugins and see File Open Web Publisher, which will confirm that the plugin is in fact installed. 